so not the most uh, fundamental move, but a, a cool, a cheeky, a cheeky little back take here that I'm going to show you guys from from that leg drag position. One that I try all the time and have tried in competitions before uh, with success and not. So <clears throat> the the basically let's turn the face this way. We're in that leg drag position. Okay. A lot of times guys don't want to get uh, points scored on them, so they turn away. But their goal is their goal is to recover their guard. So they they turn to Granby right this way, and then recover their guard right here. Boom and back in, okay? So, <clears throat> when I'm here, my goal is to, to keep my head on the far side of them over here, ideally, okay? But a guy will start to frame on you and push you away here. Okay, this becomes a bit of a problem with keeping the, the leg drag positioning, okay? And especially when he starts to grab me because now his butt is wedged between us. You can see there's some back exposure, but it's gonna be pretty difficult to get to, especially as it gets his back flat. Okay, so a lot of times when I get here, I bring my, my hands to lock. A lot of times in leg drag, like I said, I'm always trying to bring my hands together into a into a, a body lock. Okay. <clears throat> now, when I'm here, I'm still stapling this leg. Okay, this still keeps this in place. My bottom leg is going to swivel over top of this one. Okay. And this one is going. To, so I'll show you. Okay. It's a little hard to do slow, but when I get to here, okay. <clears throat> what I'm going to do is is I'm going to swivel and I have to dive under. So the direction I'm going is here, I pummel, okay? And I dive to right here, okay? You guys can see now how I found a leg drag position, okay? Or I mean, I'm sorry, crab line. Okay, both of my feet are flaring out to control, my knees are pushing into control, okay? I can switch now, well, I can keep the body lock for now until I pull him on top of me. Once he's on top of me, okay, now, I can use my hands and my crab right to drag and push him straight down into my lap. Okay, I'm gonna find a seat belt. I'm gonna keep this crab right in. It's hard for him to pummel his legs inside. I'm gonna retract one all the way up. Heel in first. Sit to that side, all the way up. Heel inside. Okay. So one more time. I think uh, you might have to change angle, but we'll see. We're here. He goes to start coming up, and, and, and I've been framed in this position by his hands. Okay, my hands are coming together. Okay, because ideally I'd like to I'd like to keep following him, but it's getting difficult. So I'm gonna actually go the other way. Okay, I have to bring this foot inside here. Okay, so I'm basically switching my staples. Biggest problem you'll run into is this leg getting caught up into a into a submission. Okay. <clears throat> So what I want is, go ahead, come back up on your, on your, come up, come back up, they're almost, okay, okay. What I want is to, to hook this leg on the far side nice and strong, okay? And then I want to roll, to pull him on top of me, okay? So here, and here, boom. Okay, once we're here, I'm gonna push at the hips, and I'm gonna straighten out, my knees tucked in, Okay, I sit him up, find my seatbelt, leg retracts, heel comes in first, cut to this side, okay, by knee points, retracts, leg inside. 